Hi, I'm Ryan Shanahan from the Beer Institute of Justice's Family Justice Program, and I'm presenting at the OJJDP conference on the value of family and helping young people transition from facilities to community, what most people call re-entry, that re-entry period. And the Family Justice Program has developed tools over the years to help both people inside facilities who are working with youth and folks who are on the community correction side work at integrating more information about family and social support and the strengths of those systems to help folks transition from the facility to the community and really create a web of support for young people as they make that transition. And so in my presentation, I'll be talking about those mapping tools that help practitioners identify areas of need and areas of strength in young people's families and social support. I'll also be talking about the Juvenile Relational Inquiry Tool, which is a really user-friendly, and you can find out more on our website, <laughs> user-friendly tool for practitioners inside facilities to get a snapshot of a young person's social support system. And I'll also be talking about the best practices around the country around family and engaging families. So for example, the Texas Juvenile Justice Commission's Parents Bill of Rights, or in Kentucky where the educators ask parents how they want to be contacted. Would they prefer to be contacted by email or by phone? Or in New York with the new Brooklyn for Brooklyn initiative where they're really focusing on keeping kids closer to home. So I'll be talking about all of these different ways that juvenile justice agencies can show that they value the importance of family because we know that that's one of the number one factors of keeping kids safe in the community.